This video will show the viewer how to take a object from the learning object repository and to use the QR code. First thing we would do, of course, is to find our resource. In this case, I have found a Schoolhouse Rock Grammar video. You notice this video is 29 minutes long. And what I'm thinking about doing with the resource that I have is it's going to be part of a display that we have out in the hallway for parents or administrators to see what we're doing in the classroom. And let's say we were working with adjectives. So I want just this section about unpacking our adjectives. What I would simply do is go down to the QR code right here, click one time. It will open up all of the things from Schoolhouse Rock. So we have to be very careful not to click the wrong QR code. For example, this first one is the entire 29 minute video. So we've got to be careful that we don't choose that one. But as we scroll down a little bit further, we'll see that chapter two is showing here for unpacking the adjectives. And since that's the one I want, I will simply right click on the QR code, copy my image, and then I'm going to place it in the document that I want to use it with, which happens to be an unpack your adjectives um, description for a bulletin board. So what I will do is just right click and paste my picture of the QR code. And then I have something I can put out on my display for my parents who are coming in the hallway, for other students in the hallway, or for my administrators in the, in the hall to say they can watch the video about adjectives. So they'll give them a little blast from the past with Schoolhouse Rock, show them about unpacking adjectives. And then it directs them to take a few minutes to read the work from the class on the bulletin board to see how we unpack the adjectives about our school. So it would be an easy way uh, to make an interactive bulletin board for the visitors within your building. The other thing we can do very similarly um, is rather than copying a QR code, the other thing that we can we can do here, um, and it's very, very similar, that's why I want to just include it in this video, is we can say uh, maybe the next thing that I'm going to study are my interjections. So I would go ahead and highlight the one that I'm looking for there. And this time, instead of going to QR code, I just want to get the link. So I can include this link. Again, this is the link for everything, each chapter. And then specifically, the one I wanted was for the interjections. So I can just cut or copy and paste that. So I'm going to copy that, go back to my document. And right here, I will give a little preview of what we'll be doing next in the classroom by right clicking here and telling it to add in the uh, website address. Again, not the way I would do it on a bulletin board, but just a way to show you that you could have uh, the permanent link or you could have the QR code copy. Hope this was helpful for you.